Question 24, 4 sevenths add 5 sevenths. Now this one's actually very, very easy because the numbers at the bottom of the fractions, which we should be calling the denominators, are the same. Now sometimes you get fractions where the denominators are not the same. And those ones are more difficult. We'll come to those later. But because the denominator is the same, it's like the unit that we're dealing with. So we're dealing with the unit of seven. So if we said four apples add five apples, the unit would be apples. So four apples and five apples would be nine apples. If we said four sausages add five sausages, the unit would be sausages. So four sausages and five sausages would be nine sausages. But because we're dealing with sevenths, seventh is the unit. So four sevenths and five sevenths is going to be nine sevenths. Because the unit is seventh, so nine sevenths. So nine sevenths is the correct answer. Now that is an improper fraction. Because the number on the top is bigger. Top number is bigger. Now what you should really be doing is converting this into a mixed number. And to do that you treat it as a divide. 9 7 means 9 whole ones divided by 7. So 9 divided by 7 is 1 with 2 remainder. But this remainder of 2 you turn it into a fraction. And that's the easy bit because once you're dealing with 7 you're still dealing with 7 in the answer. So 9 divided by 7 is 1 remained of 2 7 because we're doing 7. So it's 1 and 2 7. So in our answer box it, it's 9 7 which is equal to 1 whole 1 and 2 7 remainder 1 and 2 7.